Hey guys, it's Abby, and I created this look with my friend. It's a very spring-like soft glam, and if you guys like it, keep on watching. Oh, wow. First, we're going to start by taking this shade from the Morphe 35O palette and just apply it and put it into the crease. It could be really messy. You don't have to be all technical with it just because it's just a transition color. I did apply her foundation and I had primed her eyes before I started filming, so I used the Urban Decay Primer Potion and then I also used um, the Maybelline Fit Me as her foundation. Now to add some depth, I'm going to use a pencil brush and dip it into the brown shade of the palette and just apply it to the outer V of the eye. I like to use tape so it can create a nice eyeshadow liner effect and I'm just going to pack that on there until I get the intensity that I like. And then I'm going to go ahead and blend it out with a fluffy brush. Before dipping my brush into the palette, I'm going to go ahead and spray with the Mario Badesco spray. And then I'm taking Max All That Glitters and applying it all over the lid. And I'm using packing and wiping motions just to make sure that I get a really bright color on the lid. Moving on to the face, I'm just going to go and bronze her up a little bit using my Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit. To highlight her face, I'm using Makeup Revolution's Baked Highlighters in Peach Lights. And then for her lips, I'm just going to apply MAC Cosmetics Gloss in Stay Sweet. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.